All right, we are back. Why is there weed growing in the in the house? That's not very good. So we get bugs and shit. Anyways, we're back. Let's do some work. Right. Anyways, I have a problem. So, I went to the store and I bought chocolate milk. Sugar free chocolate. Milk. And uh, last time I bought it, it took me two days to empty a liter of chocolate. Uh, sugar free chocolate milk. So, I was like, I'm gonna buy two. Because then I have enough for four days. But I can't control myself when it comes to chocolate, so I emptied one in one day. Well, ask this witcher. He'll tell you monsters don't set traps. What's the issue? Ye or anyone ever heard of a beast setting a wagon in the road, then waiting in ambush? They're too plain dumb for that, damn it. Dumb or no, they tore a few of our lads to shreds, and we ran like rats. They deserve to be buried. Anyways, now I'm afraid I'm gonna finish the other one too. <laughs> I have to go back and buy more. I have a problem. I have a chocolate problem. Really thought you could take on this monster on your own? We had to try. If we didn't, who would? Think Larvik some kind of getaway for mutants? Which you're stopping in every week? Got a point, Carol. Willing to talk about it? Tell me what happened. Ask away. Remember what the monster looked like? It were dark. Casper thought he saw something, but... Cause I did? It was huge. It's maw all blood smeared. Bugger gutted Ungi with one claw. Near spliced him in two. Werewolf? Where it is, you were ambushed. Tell me where. Short way from here. Along the road to Lofoten. Saw a wagon crosswise the road near the woods. We barely got to it when something came rushing through the underbrush and whoosh. Blood spurted in my eyes. I wiped it away, looked, saw Einar lying dead. Hmm, interesting. Thanks. Huh, <laughs> for what? What do you witchers do once there are no basilisks? Anyways, now another problem with that is that I recently uh, read a summary of a report that said that drinking a lot of milk is actually it promotes promotes the uh, probability of getting cancer <clears throat> because of growth hormones in milk, especially for men, especially for men that are predisposed to uh, getting a prostate cancer. Family. Well, uh, luckily, I'm not predisposed, but still, that's kind of sketchy. I haven't double checked the, myself. The paper. If it's true, that is a. Uh, oh, if that's true, that's a problem because I really like chocolate milk. I like anything chocolate. Way too much. Like, I seriously got a problem. It's one of the only things I can't control myself. <laughs> around any other f kinds of food you know i can control i can portion properly <laughs> uh, but yeah, when it comes to chocolate i'm like you know how vampires what how vampires turn out when they smell blood after not having eaten like having drank any blood for a while that's what happens to me when i see chocolate <laughs> I don't know why. I've thought about it a lot. Like, what exactly is it that makes chocolate uh, makes me go insane? I've tried maybe thinking of something happened in my childhood, but I honestly can't think of anything. You're a ye dimwit. Drop one more and I'll keel haul you. Got a minute? Preparing my boat, can't you see? Nelf guardian dogs were the hunters' son. Got bigger game in mind. Morkvarg. Ah, 
So them's your apples. A rate ask away in praise of Freya. You were there when Morkvarg raided the garden. Heard you alone survived. True. I managed to flee. Great Mother was looking out for me that day. Mm -hmm. Bet she didn't give a lick about the priestesses. Apparently. Morkvarg had them bound, then slit their throats like horses for the sacrifice. And he laughed. Understand? He laughed. But Archpriestess Over cursed him with her dying breath. You are beastly now. Remain so forevermore. Ah, saintly woman. Didn't help the priestesses. Why not? How could I? Alone against a dozen raiders that... Why are you staring? Just wondering. You people, obsessed with honor, courage, and so on. But you just cut and run? Strange. I ain't proud of it. Since that day, I've been seeking a worthy death at sea. Seems the goddess, she's not seen fit to summon me. Yet. What happened to Morkvarg? Hard to believe, but fur rose through his skin, and his mug stretched forth into a muzzle like a dog's or a wolf's. He howled, long and grieving, then lunged at his men. They tried to run, but he was fast as lightning. As he killed them, clamped his jaws round their throats, they turned to ash, just like that. Ash that seeped from twixt his fangs. Not good. Curse must be complex, multi-leveled. <clears throat> Such is the Great Mother's power. We know all this, though. I mean, half of it. Thanks for your help. Oh shit, I didn't Don't have anything to drink with me. Sword. Ugh, my throat's gonna so suffer now. So <clears throat> you might hear, hear me clear my throat a few times. I apologize. Okay, let's uh, go check out what this is. But yeah, I have no idea why I'm so uncontrollable when it comes to trauma. I really don't know. I've been thinking about it for a long time. What exactly is it that makes the flavor of chocolate make me go insane? You know? Anyways, enough of that. Let's see what happened here. Mm, something really did tear him to pieces. I wouldn't say it tore him. I'd say it straight up. Cut him. <laughs> I mean, his leg seems torn, but his upper body is just straight up cut. <laughs> hmm, not much left. Beast must have dragged the shredded body to the woods. Looks like blood, but hmm. Red clay. Hmm. Necker warriors use this clay to mark their position in the pack. Creature leading the Neckers is sentient. Gotta be. Capable of setting primitive traps at least. Sing. Tracks lead into the woods. I did see the best Shireen uh, thing. Hagaba man or something? But I'm not gonna look at it because it tends to spoil. I understand what they're trying to do with the best sherry, like you're supposed to read up and um, prepare for the fight like Monster Hunter style, or I guess this Monster Hunter came after, so... But you know what I mean. Um, <clears throat> the problem with that is that the, having the best sherry thing... I just found this randomly, so check it out. The pop-up before the actual fight itself, it kind of spoils, uh, you know... A surprise but at the same time you can't have like go into it blind and then get smacked around and then having to keep doing it until you learn more and more you know because that's just the pacing of that kind of game is uh, pretty awful and people will be very unhappy but I gotta say Monster Hunter did that pretty 
pretty well actually, Monster Hunter World. If I remember correctly, you fight it over and over, and each time you learn something new. Because it's missions, mm, mission based. Not right? much left. Beast so you learn more and more about body to the woods. which mm, parts of the not body much left. Beast must have dragged the shredded body to the woods. Found a good place for their nest. So I understand why they did it this way. I just don't think it's uh, maybe not the optimal way. <laughs> What am I doing? I should probably ignite this. Damn, you're ugly. Okay. Oh shit. I don't have the Oh shit. Seems the neckers have developed an immunity to the toxin. Okay. The poison protects their nest. Clever. <laughs> That's that was close, <laughs> and I don't have my panic button. I need to meditate, honestly. Finally, the main nest. I didn't click on anything. All right. right. What do we want in terms of? Um... Sorry, hold on, I need to. Alright, back. Man, it's warm. Where I uh, where I live right now. It's like one or two weeks every year. But it's just so warm and humid and then it goes back to being normal. We're in those two weeks right now. I feel like I'm about to die. <laughs> Guess I got company. Yes, I do got company. Is that a mask or is it its face? <laughs> it's bleeding. Does that mean it dies underground or will it? No, it doesn't. I can see its HP. Why oh, it is its face? Necker claw, liver, heart, mutagen, divine sword, venom extract, necker <clears throat> Alright, we don't need to watch this. Hence to find herbs, additional herbs. No thanks. It's kind of you, but. Uh... Monster experience is where it's at for me. I'm not even sure if the experience is worth it, to be honest. Does it even make a difference? Is 5% really worth it? Over something like decapitation. I mean, dismemberment. Okay. I guess it maybe is worth it if you stack it with other sources of experience. My reward, you say? <coughs> How the hell did those cut the man in half? Based on the description of the ambush, that did not sound like it was Neckers. Let our Shalmar be your guide. 
He fell the giant. And beware of that. So will you help then? Killed the beast that was troubling you. Merciful Freya. Horson's finally dead. Now, tell us, was it a tough fight? <clears throat> Got any wounds, need dressing? No, I'll be all right. Ah, uh, nothing new to the likes of you. Hard work, witchering. All right, your reward. This here's for you. Thanks. So long. Huh, thought it was going to try to scam me. <clears throat> all right. Uh... <clears throat> Ooh, we have a shopkeeper. Uh oh, my voice is crackling because no water. To have strength to the last. God, that's annoying. Um. Thank you, Witcher. Upkeeper. I heard the boom. Greetings. Looking to buy? Looking to play Gwent. Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards. At some point, somebody's gonna have to give me a good card, right? Clear any better. Just go for Siri. <clears throat> I don't know if there is any point in playing the tens. I'm gonna play the dragon either way. Actually, I could have played the archer. That would have been better because then I can't get counter. Counter Drake. <clears throat> Interesting. Interesting strategy there, sir. It would be nice if you played some uh, spies. bit of a deep shit here. Not gonna lie, my situation is getting more and more dire now. <laughs> I really need you to play a spy now. here because I plan to put down the dragon too but I'm just waiting to see if I can hit something Two more cards in his hand. Boom past. <clears throat> no shit, I can't win. Why did I do that? No. Am I gonna lose this?
Yeah. Can I surrender? Wow, what a random game to lose. <laughs> Greetings. What is this a shit deck like that? <clears throat> awful, awful opening hand. Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards. <clears throat> I just don't have anything else to play. <laughs> I'm lacking good cards. Where are my spies, man? Fine. <laughs> Very little interaction again. <laughs> Especially versus a guy that has no... No good uh, close quarter fighters. <clears throat> okay, we might get a fighter out of this. I mean a close quarters. Close combat unit. With a dragon. hand is pretty much identical, almost, almost identical to the previous round. What the hell? Alright, now we got some stuff to do. wonder if this is pre-coded to turn out this way? I'll take that one too. Since we have the other one on the field, might as well do it right now. If I can get him to uh, surrender, that would be nice. Nice. No risk of him decoying these. Should I play the... Okay, fine. Should I play the storm card, but... <clears throat> yeah, I should definitely have played the fog. Forgot about it. Pretty much useless in this round. Let's go for it. Scorch would hurt pretty bad, but um <laughs> The AI is stupid, so it's fine. A dragon would be fine here, because I could uh, get my own dragon going. My deck draws poorly. It draws really poorly. <laughs> it doesn't happen often, but when it does, I, I... But can you toss an axe? My brother can. Vivern. Check out the Vivern.
Excuse me? There it is. Two. Wow. That's pretty, um... Pretty mediocre. Actually, it's not even mediocre. It's pretty bad. <laughs> Anyways... Let's continue. Might as well check out what's over here, then here, and then go check out this, and then move back up here. Get over here, cats. Go. Hey, yeah. Wild dog, level one. And in sight. Right, so we clear this out and uh, we get 50 crowns and uh, a new poor thingy here. Settlement. Am I mashing buttons? Yes, I am. Am I about to die from this heat and that's why I'm not putting too much thought into this? Yes, that is true. Is it because I'm about to uh, melt and not because I'm too lazy? Well, I'm also too lazy. Chickens. Oh, the rooster to be specific, I think. Area liberated. Well, I am a rebel liberator. Now, that, does this place have any oil? That's the question. Because only places with oil is worth liberating. Or natural gases, I guess. A lot of white wolves in an area with very little snow. <laughs> mm. I mean, I guess it could s snow seasonally. Then I think the fur of the wolf would change seasonally too. Or wouldn't it? I'm not sure. I don't have PhD in wolves, so... I don't know. Let's mark this. A little bit tired of the... The, um... War point being mark marked all the time. Greetings, stranger. Oh shit, I forgot to check I what the store had to offer. In up there in the main area. Chance to poison. Spent a lot of money, but we're gonna make this back. Do not worry. So much shit in here. <laughs> My game is lagging. <laughs> Give me a second. What the? It's like actual stuttering. <laughs> it's a lot of stuttering. Should have been uh, more. On top of this. So 
surprised I'm even hitting these. Here's the problem. It doesn't really have much more... Oh shit, there's a lot here too. Alright, it doesn't have much money. Um... Do I just buy shit off of him? I'm gonna have to get rid of all the crap in my inventory, so might as well. I was gonna go up and check the other store to see if that one had anything, but sorry, I'm too lazy. Let's just do it this way. All right, more. Holy crap! The stuttering. No joke. I think I probably have some junk to sell as well. Okay, let's buy this, I suppose. Let's buy one. Um, let's buy it, whatever. I might, I might need all of that. Who knows? Who knows? I mean, I'm sure somebody knows. Out, no, sir, you need more stuff. Oh, shit. Okay, uh, okay, let's see if we can sell some of this. We're actually, just out of all right, we need to empty the rest, honestly. Farewell. This is uh, breaking my game. We need to go back up to the other uh, shopkeeper here. Not ideal to spend five minutes doing this, but you know. Greetings. Here Show we are. Me. Wow, you had uh, very little to offer, and by very little, I mean nothing. He's already out of money. Call this a shop, sir? So a witcher? How can I be of service? Oh, Baxter, you haven't played, actually. What would you say? Didn't notice. It's a good thing we came back. Okay, no fog thing. Good. Something for a spy or something.
just a little bit quick. That is a spy, but... I do need some more interaction, like a dragon. Yeah, I really need a dragon. None of these are dragons. Ah, yeah, seriously, there's no point fighting over this. I'm sure I can find my way through it, but... They overinvested and the spies are now in the graveyard. So in a decoy he has uh, like Alright. Well got that for the next one. Next round works out. So we're gonna repeat the rounds, but mirror it, so I get the big one, and he gets the cards. And then I will do the same thing here. Oh, come on. Gonna have to play this out. What a set of shit draws. <laughs> really? Just, just gonna draw all the things. All right. <laughs> Interesting. I could draw. A, I could get a spy going this turn. Okay, you might play that Drake again. Let's just play it, let's see what happens. My opponent passed. I think I may be saving it for next turn, but giving my opponent 9 damage when he has this many cards. Kind of problem. Where are my good draws? What the hell? Need more interaction. Where are my spies? All of my spies are at the bottom 10. There's my dragon. Uh, start right away. Chickenest of the chickens. Alright, finally. A decoy and a spy, that's very good. And a, one of the best spies. Not the best, the best one is the... The zero damage one, that can't be bounced. It's actually very good, if he doesn't play anything here, on the close combat, this one is good. I'll play the Draker. Okay, well, that works. Remove eight damage on both spies. Can't bounce them. And he messed that up pretty big. Alright. I don't know what happens if I hit zero card. I don't know if I lose or... Let's see if he has scored. But I'm not gonna find out. Yes. That's fine. I can take a two for one. 
Maybe I should have played these to scout for the Scorch first. Um, I can't do anything about that. What I can do is this. Seems like this isn't over yet. gonna be a little bit close I think but I do have some interesting cards left here. actually no well I do I was gonna say I only have one interesting card but that was actually very good well Math from too, uh, too melted to do that. Nice. The that in the no card, thank you, sir. How can I, I love not winning anything. Jump. It's the best thing I know. It doesn't have enough. That didn't take long. Let's just buy the rest. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing with this. Sure. Give it. All of it. What is this? Is it real armor? Okay, not even... Ah, oh, nice. One more. <laughs> Need more store. You got anything else interesting to sell? Oh shit. What's gonna happen when I start selling all of these? <laughs> oh well, this is gonna have to do for now. Crafting. Alright, so nice. Uh, this episode went a little bit longer than expected, but it's fine. In the next episode, we'll uh, go do this and this, and then probably have time left over to start doing this shit. It's gonna be done, it's gonna have to be done. So, yeah. Hopefully I can knock all of this out in one episode. I don't think I can. It's probably gonna take two. Uh, and then I'll see if I do this racing garbage. We'll see. I'm not sure. Anyways, thanks for watching. Have a nice day. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.